Happy birthday to David Gilmore. David Gilmore is Pink Floyd's lead guitarist. He replaced Sid Barrett, but he is Sid Barrett. And Sid Barrett and David Gilmore, they're, just, they're the same person. They were friends anyway. Sid was David's friend. David is Sid's friend. They are friends from way back. Sid is David. David is... Well, they're like their own person. Anyway, enough about that. It's your birthday, David Gilmore. Happy birthday to you. And I'm a Pisces too. I am March the 4th and you are March the 6th. And that makes us connected. We are both Pisces. And we're not lost souls in a fishbowl because you've already written about that. Well done, David. Spot on. That's a very Pisces song. Anyway, I'm here with my friend Clive. He's like Uncle Clive. And when I was about 17 or 16, uh, 14, 13, uh, Clive used to babysit me. And basically, Clive was playing Pink Floyd The Wall. And there was a scene with all the hammers walking across. Do you remember that, Clive? Yeah. <laughs> and I'd like you to tell David Gilmore what I was like when I was watching it back then in 1984, 83. I can tell you what year it was, yeah. I, I, used, I used to play it quite a lot because that was a major part of my life and you used to come down and say, oh, what's that crap you're fucking playing all the time? Yeah. Um, but now it's a case of like, it, it's more of your life than your life is. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> So, David, I was scared, weren't I, Clive? Yeah, but I did convert him. He, he did convert me, and so did my mum. Basically, I got the message from my mum. She painted Dark Side of the Moon on my wall when I was, like, f four years old. So whenever I come down my stairs in Cambridge Road, the whole wall was Dark Side of the Moon. So when my mum finally died when I was 14, because she was very ill, rest in peace, mum, she basically, my dad told me that my mum painted Dark Side of the Moon on the wall, or they got it painted on there by someone, because she loved that album. So I got into Pink Floyd after all, all that message. Clive was getting me into it as well. And David Gilmore, I'm now such a huge Pink Floyd fan. I saw you all at Live 8, 2005. I was there. I won tickets. I've seen you at Pompeii three years ago. I've seen you at the Royal Albert Hall with Sir Richard Wright on 2006 when you made the album On an Island. So I'm a big fan of yours, and I've seen you like four or four times live. And I've seen Roger Waters a couple of times at Glastonbury. And I've seen him at Hyde Park with Nick Mason. And I've seen Nick Mason, his saucer full of secrets. I've seen all of you. you. I am such a big Pink Floyd fan. So from me, Danny Sluggett Vision, to you, David Gilmore, happy birthday, isn't it, Clive? Happy birthday. <laughs> from me and Clive, happy birthday, David Gilmore. Because we got the technology, then why can't we do it, Clive? Yeah. It's a dream that we can make real now, isn't it? Yeah. And shine on to Clive. Thank you, Clive, for not killing me. <laughs> <laughs> he hasn't finished yet. <laughs> no, <not time> yet. <laughs> shine on, David Gilmore. Happy birthday. There is southern comfort in David Gilmore. Happy birthday to you. Probably won't like southern comfort.